Hey, what's going on guys, it's Jaco, and today we're going to be playing some Shadows of Doubt. And it may not look like much, but believe me, there is a lot here. This game is set in the 1980s in a dystopian world where it is completely randomly generated, as well as the crimes and what crimes can actually happen. There's different types of odd jobs you can take on, and obviously solving the murder cases is one of my favorite things to do in this game. All the clues and tracking people down is just some of the most unique gameplay I've ever played in a game ever and it has been so much fun so let me quit talking and show you guys the video all right so here i am as detective idiot sandwich i was recently kicked out of my home i got evicted and now i live in this uh freebie home there's a lot of cockroaches running around i don't have any furniture so that's cool now i have notes on my bulletin board telling me what to do which i won't do I would go sleep until someone was murdered and i actually had a job to do but i don't have a bed so i have to sleep on a park bench all right well everyone in the city is being sick selfish and doesn't want to die so i'll find some odd jobs to do in the meantime like this job is perfect public humiliation no questions asked no questions answered cool i can't even read i think i'll be perfect for the job hey phone at turkey solutions will ring at exactly 550 answer it where the hell is turkey so what the hell is that like in the basement like near where i live okay so this is turkey no sorry this is turkey solutions this is like an establishment throw food in their face i can do that Take a photo of them to prove it happened. All right, he wants me to throw food at some guy's face. There's more information in this briefcase. Oh, is that it? I just open it up and I know everything? Okay, I don't, I don't need that then. Jackass. No, you're a jackass. Oh, he works there. Okay, so I just have to find a random guy who works at a diner and throw food at them. All right, I've stocked up on cheeseburgers to go. All right, hopefully I won't need the splint anytime soon. I tend to break my legs a lot. All right, I got my camera. So the target has brown hair, but is bald and blue eyes. They have a blood type of O positive. I don't know what information I'm really getting out of here. Oh, wait, I can look at uh, the employee photographs, of course. All right, so they're definitely not bald. Not bald. Not bald. I actually just threw... Sorry, I didn't mean to throw my cheeseburger at the wall. Sorry, it's an accident. All right, so I think it's this uh, Alexis Jones character. Hey, are you... Oh, yeah, you are Alexis Jones. Okay, well, this is gonna be easy. <laughs> Cheeseburger. There we go. There we go. I got him. All right, now we gotta take a picture. Smile, jackass. <laughs> this is the photograph I took on this old ass camera from the 1980s. Oh, he pulled a knife on me, dude. What the hell? It's just a cheeseburger. All right, here. I can just jump up through the woman's bathroom vent right here. Yeah, yep. See, look at the idiot. He can't find me. Oh, yes. And someone just got murdered. Thank you so much. New murder case. Oh. <laughs> I slipped, I think, in urine. <laughs> Ew. Alright, so I, I think that's all I have to do is now I just have to give the photograph to whatever person in the job listing. I'll be honest, I forgot where I have to deliver it, so we're just gonna work on this murder case instead. I'll be fine being out $700. I don't need it that bad anyways. I'm fine. I'm still kind of technically homeless. <clears throat> the Ritual Reaper? What the hell? Dead on my feet. What is this guy doing? Give me a second. He's like really angry at the sidewalk. I think he's gonna shoot the sidewalk. All right, and now it's a floor. Oh, I think that cop is running to go and investigate the crime scene that I'm headed to right now. So I have to beat him there. I'm also gonna open up all the elevator doors so any old person could just, you know, fall down the elevator shaft and die. Give me more work, that's for sure. All right, so... Oh, uh... You wouldn't happen to have killed this person, did you? Or right, I'm gonna try to get as much information out of this guy as possible because he's just standing over a dead body. His name is Jackson Burns. Do you... have you heard anything unusual? <laughs> he's standing over a corpse. What the hell? Alright, this guy's kind of... Do I hear gunshots? Oh my god! The police are opening fire! <laughs> what the hell? What the hell? Oh my god! Who's that? What are you talking? You do, dude. They were over here. Yeah, they're right there. They're dead. All right. Well, I might as well search the body. <laughs> Amy pistol ammunition on him. What the hell? And a gun? Wait, this guy may have actually committed the murder. <laughs> I'll take his money, of course. That's always a plus. All right, the cop is still in there investigating. What I'm going to do his job for him. Yeah. Somebody in the kitchen? Question mark. What a dumbass. Get the hell out of here. Excuse me. Oh, oh now he's opening fire at me because I took <laughs> one bad step. This uh, Jackson guy's leg is now stuck in the door. How interesting. Wait, no, he's getting up. 
Wait, wait, wait. Rats in the walls again. What the hell? What the hell? How did you do that? You don't live here. Ow! What's that bloody smell coming from? Oh, that's right. I forgot that if you don't shower, people will be able to smell you before they see you. And that's literally the description of it. So this guy might actually smell me because I do not own a any furniture. <laughs> Dude, piss off. All right, I'm going to throw down with this cop. I've had enough. It's time to die, asshole. Time to die. Yep. Yep. Time to die. Come on. It's not fair. He has a gun. Yes! Finally! Okay, we have to <laughs> investigate as much as we can before he wakes back up. Alright, we got Prince of the Victim here. Now let's search the rest of her body, see how she died. I'm pretty confident the guy running out with a gun that I took off of him was the way- Yeah, she died of a gunshot wound that was possibly from an 8mm or 9.32 caliber weapon. And this weapon fires 9.32 rounds and he had a box of ammunition. God, when that cop wakes up again in the back room, I'm gonna be screwed. You know, maybe I should arm myself. Is there like a- Oh no, there's a hammer here. Cool, I can use this as a weapon for whenever he wakes up. God damn it, it's not letting me take the- Oh no, here it is. Yep, take the weapon. It's mine. Thank you. Wait, what the hell? Why aren't there bullets in the- in the- why- why can't I shoot the gun? <laughs> I'm just whacking him over the head with it. Alright, time to get your ass beat again. Now stay asleep, please. It's for your own good. Oh, wait, what is this? Oh, let's play. Jay Burns. Wait, that, that says Jay Burns. It was this Jackson Burns guy. He left a crumpled piece of paper because he was doing some ritual thing. He left his name on the site of the crime. As well as I saw him walk out. Yeah, th these are his fingerprints. This ties him to the entire crime. All right, well, I got really lucky because I, I literally saw the killer commit the act. And the murder weapon was this. Okay, I got so lucky, but this isn't usually how it goes. But I I'll turn this in and see if I <laughs> got it right, which I'm pretty sure I did. Oh, all these elevator doors are open. Anyone could just slip out and feckin' die all 13 stories to their death. Well, we learned something today. If you know where a murder's about to be committed and you show up there on time, you'll catch the murderer literally in the act. Oh, yep, I got everything right except for arresting the killer, which I honestly didn't even need to do. Drop this gun here. It belongs to the police anyways. I did beat it out of that woman. Social credit, level up. I don't know what that does, by the way. I still have no clue. What the hell? What the hell? He pulled a gun on me. Get away from me, bro. Yeah, there you go. You're being- you're being unlawfully handcuffed for no reason. Have you heard or seen anything unusual? Nothing. <laughs> I doubt this guy's gonna be very cooperative, so I'm just gonna steal whatever he, he's got on him. Oh, he has a prop gun! It's not even a real gun! Alright, and I'm gonna take the key to his apartment, and then we'll- we'll just go rob him. He wants to be a smartass and try to rob me. Alright, this is gonna be so easy. It's gonna be the easiest money I've ever made. Cause I need furniture for my house. Hopefully no one's home. That would be awkward. Ooh, he's got plenty of money. Is that a diamond in his cabinet? It is. I think it is a diamond. Holy crap. These things go for like a thousand each. Nope. Oh, no, 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 no nothing. Nothing. No, no one's here. No one's here. Ow. Stand still. Ow. Stand still. Stand still. <laughs> got him. Close the door so no one thinks I'm doing anything suspicious in here. All right. I'll take the key to your apartment and all your money. Thank you. As well as this gun, this is mine now, because you want to be all irresponsible with it. I don't feel very comfortable with that. Alright, and then I'm just going to beat you to death, because you're annoying. Somebody do something, she's screaming for her life. <laughs> Alright, you know, I think she's had enough. There is literally blood lathered all over the walls. And uh, I'm just going to lock the door so she won't get out anymore. And I'm just going to continue stealing from the rest of this home. What's that stench? She says, oh, I can finally shower, actually. I should do that. I'm going to use the shower while she's handcuffed at the door. She can't do anything. Can you quit freaking out? Relax, dude. <laughs> I'm just doing office chair right at her forehead. I don't actually got to solve the murders. I just got to commit crimes myself. It's a lot easier, too. You don't actually have to use your brain or... Oh, they had uh, an engagement ring here, too. Okay, I can steal that and sell that for some extra money. All right, I think I got everything I could out of this place. What the hell? It's not letting me take my cuffs pack. All right, well, you're just going to have to be really used to being like this. Sorry. I tried to uncuff you. You, you saw me do it. Hello there, neighbor. Oh, hey, Rishi. Now, don't worry about your wife. She's like... 
been beaten half to death. Yep, just walk right past her. Okay. All right, well, I know a black market sort of place where I can sell some of the stuff I stole, so let me head there right now. Ah, the pawn shop people are locked, of course. Wait, why are you running around with a knife, kid? What are you doing? Relax, relax. Okay, this actually, this job actually looks kind of cool. I, it's like a tailing operation. Though we hate that in most open world games as gamers, it sounds pretty cool for this game. Somewhere in your immediate vicinity is a citizen with a briefcase. First is an average build and tall. Okay, black hair and blue eyes. All right, I think I'll just look for the person holding the briefcase to give me the briefcase. It will soon leave to exchange the briefcase with another individual. Oh, we need you to the tail of the citizen, photograph the exchange if you can you don't have a briefcase where the hell oh here's the guy with the briefcase all right where are these where are these feckers headed yeah this camera's ugly all right there they are there they are they're still walking there they don't have a... oh oh god oh god oh god i didn't know that the cameras what no no no, no. I, I live here i literally live here or wait no do i live here i don't think so oh shit hold on i gotta get rid of that no i don't want to take a picture of that <laughs> padlock i want to turn it off turn it off they're beating the hell out of me no 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 okay all right that's off i'm gonna die though jesus christ i turned off the machine guns though luckily holy crap Ow, ow, I've been shot and murdered. God damn it. All right, but with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed. I would love to stream this game or show off more to this game because I'm absolutely in love with it. This is such a cool, unique sandbox. I uh, never even could fathom that it's randomly generated and stuff. It is just such a cool game. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you are new, consider subscribing. And in the meantime, check out some more of my videos here, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.